subscribe. If this is what I think it is, I might be I might be one of the most exciting gamers ever in my life. So, in case nobody knows uh, what's happening, I was playing PS4 one day, and I was like talking to my buddy, and I was like saying, you know what though, maybe I'll play some Mortal Kombat X, and then I realized I had to un I uninstalled the game, so I had to reinstall it, and to make matters worse, I had to un I had to erase, uninstall some shit off my PS4. I finally got so fucking pissed that I just thought to say enough is enough, so I went to Best Buy's website the other day, and I finally bought myself. Uh, an external hard drive. Uh, yeah, that this is what it looks like before you add the shipping and the hand and the HST on top. Because here in Can here in Canada, we used to have used we used to have a, a GST and PST, and then all of a sudden though people decided though to like harmonize them together, which is called harmonize the HS which is now HST now. Money-wise aside, though, I this was supposed to be coming in Wednesday. Today is Tuesday, though, so. But anyway, though, uh, yeah, it's a little weird. Maybe a day before, I can see someone having, I can see some of you guys right now having suspicious thoughts, like a day before. You know what, though? I take it a I take it as a I I take it as a better sign that when you get your packages a day early, I find that better when you get them a day early. But anyway, I got this big package in the mail. Sorry, I'm not showing my name or my address or anything. It's all here on the front anyway, though. I almost did at one point. If I did, I'm probably gonna edit it out. But anyway, though. This is hard to get off since it's all taped up shut. Let's do this shit. I'm gonna hold the box this way. So that that was then when I open the box up, the, the the personal information is not showing because the personal information is right over here. Okay, all right, we're in. Yep, yep. I got myself an external hard drive for my PS4. This is actually it. This is what I this is what I ordered online. I'm looking forward to this. As you see, this is what this is how you mount it on your PS4. You have the whole console right here. You sit it on there. I I'm kind of looking forward to this now. Thankfully now though. Uh, Thankfully now, though, when I finally uh, have the PS4 Gamecast this Friday, I'll, you guys will be a little, you guys will realize, though, there's going to be a little more juice added to this console by the time I have the PS4 Gamecast this Friday. Anyway, let's go, let's go quickly open this up and see what I got myself into. But yes, I kind of wanted an external hard drive for a very, a very freaking long time. But I kind of had like with a thought going through my head, like uh, PS4 games and PS4 externals don't really exist. And if I wanted to buy one, I I should. And I, and I already saw like PS4 Pros with one terabyte hard drives instead. And I was like thinking instead about getting that. And then my friend Dad Quince is like, no, no, buy an external hard drive. Just Get an external hard drive. So, Dad Quincy, if you're watching, you better be glad. I I finally decided now to get an external one for you, for you, Dad Quincy. Well, this is for myself, though, still, but still. Um. Oh, okay. There we go. 
I had to take. There's this little flap thing that I had to like. Although, like I said, though, now that I, that I have more juice to my PS4, as you guys, you guys already watched it. If you guys already watched it, the episode of Sega Talks, you know, I'm kind of feeling like uh, making the PS4 Gamecast come to an end pretty soon. I, it wasn't a long, it wasn't going to be a long uh, thing like the, like the Gamecast were on my Twitch channel, I'm afraid. I still like to do, I still like to find some fun games. But so far though, right now, the only games I'm thinking of doing now for for now though are just Castlevania Symphony of the Night and The Binding of Isaac. Everything else that, that comes out for PS4 doesn't really impress me. Yes guys, that even includes the PS4 remake of Final Fantasy VII. I never did play it back then when it was new on PlayStation. And I still just, uh, and I still want to forbid myself all these years later even because I know it was one of the biggest selling games on the PlayStation back then. I had Nintendo 64. I played other stuff. I am. Uh, I do. Uh, I do like other stuff today that came out on P. That was originally for PlayStation, which, which is now coming out now. Ironically, like Crash Bandicoot, the whole trilogy. I never actually played the the entire trilogy back then, and and Castlevania Symphony of the Night. I know that I'm getting off topic. Let's just, uh, get, let's just get this out first. Little plug here. I'm guessing this is a, you. I'm guessing this is what you plug into your console. Hmm. I am looking forward to this. I really. I'm looking forward now to putting this up to my PS4. Ah, look at this, guys. There's an HD button on the front of the on the front of this thing. I don't know what that's supposed to be for. Oh, hang on. This is like between 2.5 and 3.5 .3 hard drives. Press the HD button while console is turned off. But plugged in. Oh, there's actually like a little cover here and then right afterwards the buttons down here and the slide and the slide right here is just mm. I'm still deciding I'm, I'm still deciding the stuff right now anyway I'm gonna go I'm gonna go look into the instructions uh, off video but as you guys see now, external hard drive for PS4. I'm excited. I've been wanting one for, like I said, I uh, I was playing Mortal Kombat X the other day, and I got so pissed off that I had to uninstall some shit that I was just like, I was like, I had enough of this. It's time now. I got myself an external hard drive for my console. So now I got myself some. So now I got myself some beefier juice now to add to this console. Anyway, this is the Sega Camp Gamer, guys, and I'll see you guys later. But why do I sound so casual when I say beefier juice?